All right, so I've done a video like this before where, um, let me enable that, where I've compared masked versus full geometry foliage with Nanite in Unreal Engine. So I wanted to do a newer one with a tree that's a little more representative of what you'll get when you buy a foliage pack on the marketplace. So this is absolutely not meant to be against the creator of these trees, Decagon. Uh, they make great products. I just picked a random one that I had that was masked. So this is the original tree. The Nanite version of it. It is 24,000 triangles. And the total compressed size, if you were to compile it in a build, be 0.6 megabytes. So not very much. Uh, so I took the same tree and I cut out the leaves. So we have a full geometry version here. Uh, this one will end up being 17 megabytes, or almost 18. And it's 1,281,701 triangles. So the trunk on both of them is using the same material. The leaves, as you can see here, I just set it to opaque, left everything else the same. Uh, then we have the original material, also the same, but masked. So I wanted to compare the performance difference between the two. And let's see which one comes out better. Uh, this video is an Unreal Engine 5.5, by the way. They had some improvements to rendering masked nanite meshes. So I'm curious to see how much of a difference we're going to see between the two. So as you can see here, I've already painted uh, 27,500 of the masked version. I'm going to match all of the settings between the two so we don't have any big differences. Uh, no culling distance. I want this to be as representative as possible of the difference between the two. Normally you wouldn't paint a forest this dense, but you might, so. Uh, otherwise, all I've done is set shadow cache to static and limit the WPO distance, which is pretty standard for any of these you're going to work on. Okay. So this won't be purely scientific, per se, but I pulled up stat unit over here, so you can see we're at roughly 85, 86 FPS, and about 10.4, 10.5 milliseconds in the GPU. Uh, game thread shouldn't be affected much by either one of these, but that is also visible. Okay, so now we we'll turn this speed down and we'll go down in the forest. Uh, first, we're going to pull up how it looks in Overdraw View. So, this is the Overdraw for the masked version. As you can see, it's pretty rough. Uh, in my last video, it did get better when I was down in the forest, so I'm curious to see. It is still pretty bad here. And there you can see the actual masking. Back in normal lit mode, it might be kind of hard to see in the video, but it is indeed better being down in the forest. About 97, 98 FPS with about 9 point Somewhere between 9.3 and 9.5 on the GPU. So we'll just kind of go through here a little bit, see what happens. Oops. 
Looks like we're staying pretty steady around the 90, 95 mark. GPU usage it seems to stick around 9.5 to 10.5. Still pretty bad on the overdraw. So I'm going to come back in just a second after I replace these with the full geometry version and we'll check again. Alright. To keep the test as accurate as possible, I replace them directly where they were. So every tree is in the same place as it, as it was for the masked portion of the video. So as you can see here, still the same, 27,500, no calling, static shadow cache, 5,000 on the WPO distance. So the overhead view here, we're getting about 106 FPS and about just under 8 milliseconds on the GPU. So let's take a look at Overdraw. Much better. Bit worse down here in the forest, but not quite as much. I imagine we'd see some pretty good results if we bumped up the try count of the trunks. Yeah. So in this spot, we're sitting at about 8.3, 8.2 milliseconds in the GPU, and about 108 FPS, somewhere around there. Well, not bad. So the main consideration you'll be looking at between masked versus full geometry will be the disk space, which it's going to take more if you're using full geometry uh, due to the leaves being completely cut out. The geometry is much more dense. So if disk space is a problem, it's worth considering using masked because it will work. But if you just want the most performance possible, definitely a noticeable uplift with full geometry.